Finally, let's use R to calculate a T statistic for independent samples. We're going to use some of the same data before, but instead of this being repeated measures, we're going to test group A with their free throws, and they're going to have these scores, 30, 28, 14, 24, and 35. And group B, the ones who get the actual practice, get 32, 30, 17, 37, and 50. So the question is, is there a difference significant between groups A and group B? Just to be a little bit masochistic, we're going to actually use the formula and figure all of this out. So we're going to calculate x bar for A is the mean of A, x bar for B is the mean of B, s squared sub A is the variance of A, so we'll just call it, um, well, s2 dot A, that's the variance of A, s2 for B is the variance of B. And our t statistic should be the absolute value of x bar for A minus x bar of B divided by the square root of the variance of A divided by the number of A plus the variance of B divided by the number of entries in B. And we get 1.093 as our T statistic. And then again, we could look it up in our table. It turns out there are eight degrees of freedom here because there are five entries for the A category, 5 for the B category. 5 plus 5 is 10, minus 2 gives us our degrees of freedom when we're doing a two-independent sample t-test. But again, why don't we let R do the work for us? R can do all this work for us to say we want a t-test of B against A, and then we want to have the paired, in this case, to be false. We still want the variance of equal to assumption to be true. And we'll do a two-tailed test in this case to see if there's a difference. We don't care which way it is. We just want to see if there's a difference at all. And there we get this. And it turns out that the p-value is 0 0.3. 0 0.3 means this could have happened by chance about one time out of three, which means we don't hit our 0.05 level. We do not have a significant difference. We keep the null hypothesis, namely group A and group B, on the average, have the same mean number of free throws.